Let's take a look at a few in-depth examples of co-branding. At any given time of the year, there's likely to be some kind of food festival. It may seem like this is a tough place to set up an insurance booth, but what if you created a reason for people to visit? Like Slushies, find a company that has a machine and share a booth. They provide the drinks and you provide the co-branded cups. You could even use peel and reveal stickers on the cups where people can win another slushy or a branded tote bag. You can team up with any small local food business. Coffee and donut shops are easy to love. They provide the food and drink and you provide the cups and trays with the call to action for both companies. Maybe it's a summer day and you want to team up with a local ice cream brand. They're going to need spoons and dishes, right? Your name can be on each and every one. The appeal to do a co-branded booth is to lower the marketing cost and increase the value of the booth giveaway. Be fun by association. Instead of worrying about competing with other booths, join a brand that people know and love. Let's say there's a car show in town. Everyone needs auto insurance, right? This is the perfect place to pair up with an auto-related brand. Imagine their t-shirt with your logo on the back. Someone wears the shirt because it has a brand they love, and then your brand is associated with it just by being on the shirt. How many times do you think it will be worn and seen? This is what's called cost per impression. The more times a product is seen and used, the lower your cost per impression. Spending one dollar on a giveaway that's used once or twice and thrown out is much more costly than a five dollar giveaway that's used 20 times and stays around for years. Tying a non-tangible service like insurance to a tangible brand like NASCAR allows viewers at your booth to have fun rather than see it as a chore people then become a walking billboard for your brand. When you co-brand, you piggyback on another company's large marketing spend and are viewed in the same positive light simply by association. For a truly successful event, you need to create a buzz with activities and give people a chance to connect with a brand they love. 